Okay, now that we have uh, our pre-streaming preparation done, uh, we can now move on to just checking uh, the best settings hardware-wise to, uh, to do the streaming. Uh, and we can do this by coming to video uh, and the auto-detect video settings. So this is where PCS Pro will detect uh, the best settings uh, relative to your laptop setup and what hardware and software you have installed. So we can click on there and it will run the tool, um, but we can also do it through tools, conf configuration, video capture, and come to here. So I'm just going to do it from uh, this one instead. Uh, so here we can see you have run that tool very quickly and you can see here that a couple of the settings are, are not the recommended settings. Uh, so I can click uh, apply and it will change uh, those settings for me uh, automatically. I can then come to the live streaming tab and most uh, play career clubs that we think will be streaming to YouTube. So um, we will select YouTube from uh, the streaming service drop down. Uh, from your account, you will then get the stream key that you will need uh, to live stream to your event. Um, and by default, the streaming will go to 720p um, at a target bit rate of 2,500. Um, it will then give you a, an estimate of how much uh, data per hour this will take to stream. However, there are other settings under this drop down for resolution. So you can go up to 1080p if you wish to stream in the highest possible quality uh, or down to 480 uh, if, for example, you've got uh, bandwidth uh, issues uh, or need to, to stream at the lowest uh, possible resolution for other reasons. Uh, but 720p at 2.5 should be good. But if we change to 1080p, it will give a higher bit rate as well. Uh, if you do experience buffering uh, in your stream, then you can drop the target bit rate down uh, manually so you don't have to stick to that default uh, depending on which uh, resolution you have uh, selected. So, for example, if we are in 720p that we don't want to drop below, we can change the standard 2000 bit rate, which will just reduce the, uh, the amount of data and, and frames that um, are being sent. So we can then go OK, and we're then uh, ready to stream, which we won't actually start yet. We'll do that uh, in the next video.